It is teacher Miss Cynthia here with you. Today we're gonna be reading a book. Does anyone know what book we're gonna be reading today? Hmm. The book that we're gonna be reading today is called My Shadow by Robert Louis Stevenson. This is our front cover of our book. Does anyone know what this is called? It's called The Spine. And does anyone know what this part of the book is called? It's called The Back Cover. So on the back cover it says, A Child, His Shadow, and a Timeless Children's Classic. So here we have a little friend. And what does that look like? shadow it looks like he's playing with his shadow right so should we start our book yeah let's start our book do you see our friend he is doing a handstand he's doing a dance pose he's standing on one foot and on this one he's laughing What's on this page? <gasps> what is he doing? He's tiptoeing. And right in here, he's jumped into the air. And on this one, what does it look like he's doing? He's waving to his shadow. And right here, he's sticking his tongue out to his shadow. Let's see what's on the next page. My shadow by Robert Louis Stevenson and it's illustrated by Sarah Sanchez. Does anyone know what illustrated means? It means that person's the one that drew all the pictures in here. Here we go. I have a little shadow that goes in and out with me. Do you see this little shadow? It's going out the door with him. And what can be the use of him is more than I can see. Whoa, look, the cat got scared by his shadow. His books and his cup and straws created a different shadow. He is very, very like me from heels his heels up to his head and I see him jump before me when I jump into bed so you see them jump before him when he jumps into bed the funniest thing about him is the way he likes to grow so can we see how his shadow likes to grow? So right here, his shadow is very small, right? And then what happens? His shadow starts to grow. Now it's bigger than him. Not at all like proper children, which is always very slow. So our friend is saying that he grows slower than his shadow. He goes up here, halfway above the door, and his shadow goes all the way out here, almost as tall as the door. For he sometimes shoots up taller like a bouncing rubber ball do you see he's all the way out here and the shadow grew all the way out to here and he sometimes gets so little that there's none of him at all do you see any of his shadow 
I don't see any at all. It's so, 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 so tiny that his shadow is under his shoe. He hasn't got a notion of how children ought to play and can only make a fool of me in every sort of way. So his shadow ends up giving away where he's hiding. His friends are playing hide and seek and he is hiding from his friends. But his shadow showed his friends where he was hiding. He stays so close beside me. He's a coward, you can see. Can you see? His shadow is right behind him. I'm too brave to stick to mommy as that shadow sticks to me. So he says he's too brave. He's braver than a shadow. He does not need to hide. He doesn't need to stick to his mommy. One morning, very early, before the sun was up. Hmm, what do you think he did? He's looking out the window. Hmm. What is he going to do? I rose and found the shining dew on every buttercup. So do you know what a buttercup is? A buttercup is this type of flower right here. And what he's saying is that he went to go find the shining dew. Shining dew is like water droplets that make the flowers shine. But my lazy little shadow with a naughty sleepy head had stayed at home behind me and was fast asleep in bed. Do you see? His shadow's still sleeping in bed. The end. See, our shadow's waving goodbye. Goodbye. And that is the end of our book my friends so today we have read my shadow and our activity for today is going to be to go outside and find your shadow and draw your shadows outline and remember to take pictures so that we can all see what they look like and then i will see you on wednesday for wednesday's activity be sure to collect some leaves before we start so that we can draw our leaves together okay so we'll see you on wednesday my friends bye bye